It's election day and you cast your vote, but will it be counted? Will the election be fair? It's a process where trust is eroding. According to a 2020 Harvard poll, 38% of Americans lack confidence in election fairness. Now, we've been using the paper ballot voting system since the beginning of the 19th century, and for a system that has been in place for over two centuries, there have been a lot of errors and dramas. It was a rigged election. If you look at the different states, the election was totally rigged. Uh, it's a disgrace to our country. It's like a third world country. These ballots pouring in from everywhere, using machinery that nobody knows ownership, nobody knows anything about. I'm Forecast Justin Solomon, and this is The Great Disruption. So our traditional voting system has some shortcomings. For one, every vote is cast by hand, which makes it extremely inefficient and leaves plenty of room for error and disagreements. Hanging chads, anyone? And once your vote has touched the bottom of the ballot, there's no way for voters to personally know whether it was counted or not. So it lacks that end-to-end -end verification. Presidential elections also come with high costs. First, there's the need for enough accessible voting centers for citizens. Then you need a lot of actual people to oversee the process, like polling station managers, counting managers, and law enforcement, just to name a few. Once all of this is done, all the paper ballots have to be gathered and transported into one place to be counted. Adding to the system's inefficiency, votes are counted by hand or by a voting machine, and those machines often malfunction. Voting machines themselves are vulnerable to fraud since they are in public locations during the elections. And even if we don't factor in human error, actors with malicious intent could theoretically add fake ballots and manipulate the election results. There have been accusations volleyed from all sides, a political mess. But here's where blockchain technology can reinforce this democratic process. Blockchain can introduce a tamper-proof digital voting system that allows citizens to vote from the comfort of their homes. Voting from your couch sounds pretty good if you ask me. That means no more voting centers and the high costs that come along with setting them up. No more paper waste, and no need to manually count millions of votes. Sounds a bit more 21st century, right? Imagine a voting system where people cast their votes from their laptops or smartphones. It's just as anonymous as the paper ballot system, except each vote can be verified throughout the election process. This is the promise of a blockchain-based voting system in a nutshell. And that's not all. Blockchain can make the voting process more transparent and verifiable. It also makes it more secure, as each network node has a copy of the shared ledger where votes are encrypted as blockchain transactions. So if a hacker were to try to manipulate the votes, he'd have to hack the shared ledger across hundreds of computers at the same time. And there's no centralized point of failure. This is what makes blockchain voting tamper-proof. And as there would be little question about the authenticity of the votes, we could ultimately see this restore trust in democratic elections. Some countries are already experimenting with blockchain-powered voting systems. Sierra Leone was the first country to run blockchain-based elections in 2018. Since the votes were anonymously stored on an immutable ledger, citizens could access the results in real time. The same year, the US also trialed a blockchain voting system for soldiers serving overseas. The Philippines is also looking to incorporate blockchain voting for its diaspora to improve voter turnout and public trust. Blockchain voting can help amplify the voices of citizens worldwide and not just during political elections. It could be implemented to democratize other government decisions like new legislation or budget allocations. But the greatest hope behind blockchain voting is that it will create more inclusive voting systems and restore trust, the most valuable trust one could have in their country.